Welcome back guys to a brand new video and today guys we're gonna be doing something I really want to do for a very long time ever since I realized it was in the game and that is doing trade-ups. Now I know it's called crafting in this game but they basically got the idea from CSGO trade-ups and if you don't know how it works it is pretty simple. Let's go ahead and take this MP7 off-road for example. All you gotta do is take 10 skins that are kind of similar. They have to be from the same rarity level which is um epic for this um mp7 and from the same collection which is rival so for example if we just craft these up real quick i have 10 skins right now which are all from the um rival collection and all epic skins. If we, if we take all these it's going to take all 10 of our skins and then it's going to give us one skin from the rival collection except it won't be an epic it'll be a legendary so it's definitely pretty cool and it's kind of fun to play with you can kind of get lucky and maybe even make profit depending on what skin you get but yeah it's just something really fun to do and you can do it with multiple um of course reload for example if you just take the uncommons right here i mean the rares you're going to be able to get an um epic if you take the epics you're going to be able to get a legendary and of course you can't take anything with the arcane because there's no tier above arcanes but we might be able to get lucky here and maybe you get get a knife and make a lot of profit now honestly this is not supposed to be like a super scientific video trying to find the best um trips you can possibly do and the reason i'm not doing it because there's not a lot of trips you can do in this game it's only three collections versus like csgo where you see a lot of trade up videos there's like 20 to 30 collections in that game and of course there's different like um there's like um battle scarred and of course factor new so there's a lot of different aspects of which makes it a lot more complicated but in this game pretty much everybody knows about every trade up possible so we're going to be doing four trade ups today one from each collection i think we also have one from the uncommons i forgot which collection it's from but it should be definitely fun and hopefully maybe we can get a knife now also i just want to say one thing when you are trying to do these um what's it going you're trying to do these trade ups Let's say you're trying to, let's say I'm trying to um, trade up my legendaries from the Furious collection to get an, um, an arcane. Go for the cheapest um, legendary wep legendary skin. Don't take the op gear, take the shotgun because no matter what, you still have the same chance of getting one of the skins. So you try to take the cheapest skin in that rarity collection, which is that's why I took the um, shotgun necromancer. But let's go ahead and start this off. This should be definitely really fun. And I'm gonna be really curious if we're gonna be able to make any profit. But again, that really wasn't the point of this video. I'm just kind of doing it for entertainment purposes. So let's go start off with the camouflages. Now, I mean, not camouflages, but the um, uncommons. Now I did do this one. You know, I only spent two gold. These skins are like super cheap. So let's see if we can make a little bit of profit on here. Of course, we're going to be able to get a rare skin from this. But let's see if we can make profit. So we're taking one, two, three, four. Yeah, we got ten. Let's go ahead and craft these up and see what we get. And we got a pixel camouflage rare. I don't think we made profit off of that one. I really don't. Let's go ahead and see here. Find on the marketplace. That's, on, that's worth less. It's worth less than all ten skins. Okay, we didn't make any profit off of those nowhere close that was that was horrible that was definitely not a good one at all but i don't even want this let's go ahead and just sell this i don't want this i don't want this at all it's a garbage skin let's go ahead and sell it for 1.18 sorry for anybody who likes this skin but i'm just not a fan of it but let's hopefully we can get better luck with the rare skins but it's just something kind of fun to do but again you're not always going to make profit i'm pretty sure there's some you can get pretty lucky on especially i'm really hoping i get lucky on those shotguns and get a knife but let's go ahead and do the rare skins next. We have all these shotgun pathfinders. Let's go ahead and craft them. But again, as I said, they don't have to be the same exact skin. They just have to be the same rate level. But I just hold the same exact skin because these are actually the cheapest ones you can get. So let's go ahead and craft these. Let's go ahead and take 10. Let me go skip around my op here. And by the way, I did spend 14 gold on these. So let's see what we get here. Come on, something, something good, something good. Oh, man, the neon. I don't think this is worth anything. Let's see, how much is this worth? This is worth... Oh, it's only worth about nine, nine gold. So no profit there either. We're getting pretty unlucky though. Cause like, for example, let's say if I just go over here, what was that? What's that neon from the, no, it's not from, I think it's from the Fierce collection, right? No, it's from the, it's from the origin. Yeah, it's from the origin collection. Let's say for some reason I got lucky and didn't get an um neon and I got a, a cyberpunk i think these are worth a lot more i think i might be wrong about that but we can get lucky and make profit there's just not a high chance in doing these trade-ups okay let's go ahead and move on to the epic okay for the epics i spent 125 golds these were definitely a lot more expensive and i'm really hoping we can get something nice out of these come on come on let me get something good here let's see we're gonna go ahead and craft these up oh my gosh we got a necromancer i think this might be no i don't think they made profit let's see that i don't think he's, i think he's like for what a hundred let's see here oh wait 
Okay guys, for some weird reason, my recording crashed in the middle of the video. That has never happened before. I am sorry about that, guys. Luckily, I realized it a little before I started doing any other trade up, but right when we crashed, I got my AK Necromancer. And luckily, this is the first trade up we actually made profit off of. This um this sells for about 180, 190 gold, and I only spent 125 gold on all those um epic skins combined, which is definitely really good. Now, of course, that up to takes about 20% of your gold when you are selling items on the store. So we really we only made about um we only made about 25 gold off of this trade up but that's enough gold to put us in the positive so oh, after after all three trade ups we did technically we actually made a little bit of money off of this which is definitely really good and of course if you're just going to keep the skin it'll be really nice but of course i have a bunch of nice AKs, so i'm not going to keep this but yeah this is definitely a really good trade up here now hopefully we can get lucky with the legendaries because i spent 500 gold on these legendaries of course legendaries are expensive when you're buying 10 of them it's, it can be it can be really risky now if we get a knife out of this we are soaring in profit if we get anything else we are super unlucky so oh man I, I just want a knife give me a knife I think we have a good chance of getting the knife too let's just go ahead and craft it why 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 a p250 I think that's the worst thing we could have got okay now we're deep in the negatives before we're making profit yeah these sell for about okay I see some in the 500s but they really sell for about four hundred gold and I spent 500 gold so I think right now in this video we're probably somewhere around negative a hundred gold after all these trades but what I was trying to say was I was hoping we could get lucky because for example if you go ahead and go to the freeze guys and look right here we could have got all these different skins we could have got a knife if we got a knife man we would we would have been soaring in profit I think I think these knives sell for about two thousand gold if I'm not so let me go check what I really want to check here yeah, those knives um this is a karambit right Where's the karamba that's up here? Yeah, these knives, they sell for 3,000. They all sell for 3,000. So we could have got lucky and made 250,000. I mean, not 250,000, that would be ridiculous, but 2,500 gold off of this. But sadly, we got the cheapest um arcane skin out of the freeze collector. I mean, let me check here. I'm pretty sure that is the cheapest one. Yeah, no, we could have got the FAMAS. The FAMAS is actually worth less. But I was really hoping we can get a knife. Now, I, I want to ask you guys a question. You know, the rarity level arcane, is there like a difference between the guns and the skin? Because looking at this, if they're all the same rarity level, I should have the same chance of getting the gun as getting the knife, which means there were two guns and there were four knives. So I had around about a 66% chance of getting the knife, if my math is correct. But I could be wrong about that. Let me know, though. But if, it, if you do have the same chance of getting the arcane gun as the arcane skin, you have a 66% chance of getting a knife. And if that is true... Somebody fact check me on that, but if it is true, it would actually make sense to keep doing this trade ups and you should have a good chance of getting the knife and make profit. Should I do another one? I'm really tempted. You know what? We're doing two. We're doing two because I really want a knife. I'm, I'm, I know this might sound stupid, but I really want a knife here because I really want to prove my theory. Now, of course, we can get super unlucky, but let's just go ahead and get almost the cheapest epic skin we can buy. I'm just curious. It's the cheapest epic skin is a shotgun, I'm pretty sure, right? Um, price, not price, um, apply, price. This video's getting pretty long, I can already feel it. I had to double check make sure my recording's not crashing. I'm kind of worried about that again. We're gonna, we're gonna do it again. Again, this is not, we're not trying to make profit off of this. It's just for entertainment. We're buying 10 more. I'm not even trying to buy this one again. This video is, it's kind of a stupid video. We're just doing it again. Wasting money. I really want, I'm not, I'm not even keeping up how much I just bought. Did I get 10 already? I wasn't, oh, we got eight. We got eight. Okay. And of course, I already have one, um, I already have my main one I use. Let's go ahead and buy two more. Come on, give us a knife. Give me a knife. I right, so if we get unlucky twice, guys, just type a bunch of Fs in chat. I took a, I took an L today, but you know what? Two Ls make a W. So, okay, come on. Give me give me the karambit. Give me a karambit. Oh my gosh, I don't even want to look. And after thinking about that for a while, I wasted two hundred gold. That's about eight dollars. Now, either two things. Number one, my hypothesis was completely wrong. Arcane guns do not have the same rarity level as arcane knives, or I'm super unlucky. There is only, let me see here, it was a one out of three chance two times, so that's one out of nine, which is somewhere around about a 10% chance of me getting a gun twice in a row. So either that happened, but or the more likely is that the guns are much less rare. The arcane guns are much less rare than the arcane knives. It's, it's one or the other, but you know what? I'm just gonna leave these two P250s here. 
selling for 700 gold. If, if you want to help me out and somehow make this video into a video that made profit, yeah, they're right there. I don't know. But if you want to buy those and waste money, go ahead. But anyway, guys, I, I don't say. I'll uh, just buy.